morning. I'm looking for the village of Stolin. You're going the wrong way. They turn around and take the south road for about 16 kilometers. Then bear right. You can't miss it. Thanks. What are you doing in these parts? What? You are not Swedish. I come from Dortmund originally, but I live in Stockholm now. I have spent some time in Germany myself. Come now! Mon! What's happened to your memory? I can't... Major Arthur! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, it's no great story. My sister was married to a Swede. And after I escaped from the internment camp, I hid out with them. I am Lars Lofqvist now, inspector of the power company. And now what about you? I come up here on a job for the Comrades Organization. In Sweden? My God, what's going on? Uh, can you tell me, or would it violate orders? Not to hell with orders. I'm sick of orders. I'm up here on Storlean to kill a school teacher on Saturday. But don't ask me why. I cannot make head or tail of it. Who is this teacher? Lundberg? Olafsson? Lundberg. But I don't know what he looks like. <sighs> no doubt he's probably a harmless old man. It doesn't make any sense. It makes sense to your superiors. Or they wouldn't have given you the assignment. An order is an order. Good God, man! You are an officer of the SS! Have you forgotten? My honor is loyalty. Those words were supposed to be engraved on your soul. I know Lundberg. I will point him out to you. It isn't Lundberg. <laughs> It doesn't have to be Saturday. 